So Applied Technologies is really a unique opportunity here in the state of Arizona. It's an environment that is different from all other high schools. These are actually some of the best students I've ever taught. And they can do anything, anything that they put their mind to. We go beyond just the rote in the classroom. Nowhere else can you go and get all of your core academics, your English class, your math class, your science class, everything you need for your high school diploma, and high quality career and technical education programs that are gonna set you up for your career. The automotive program here at ALA, Applied Tech, is the most extensive high school experiences that students can experience. I would say my favorite part is just being able to work on a car, like up in the air, like having all the tools available to me, which is awesome because, well, you know, it's just like a dream come true pretty much. These students are becoming proficient. They're gonna be ready and rearing to go right out of high school. So the cosmetology program here at Applied Tech is seriously so much fun. We have so much fun every day. Um, all of us are friends and all of us together, we're a team and we learn off of each other. And you, they learn from me, but they also see how other students are doing it um, and learn are able to pick up from each other. Um, I love how, how this program sets up all the students for success and how I know that once they graduate, they're gonna be ready to go. They're gonna ready, be ready to hit the ground running in cosmetology and hopefully um, grow to have as much passion as everyone around us does. I chose to be a part of the cosmetology program because of how hair can help you express your creativity and like all the different things you can do with hair. We have a joint program with hospitality and culinary. Students can choose either path. They get to use commercial stoves, ovens, um, deep fryers. They get to use a commercial dish machine, so they learn the fun side of doing dishes. And they actually get to use everything you'd find in the restaurant and hotel in our kitchens. You develop great friendships. You get along with everyone in here because you're doing the same thing. And then the teachers are always just amazing. This program will prepare you for the basics. You may, you will repeat those items in college, but just with different chefs as we teach you different things. But you already have a knowledge level of the ingredients and the skills to be well ahead of your peers who are all in that program also. In our education program, we have built it out, not just to prepare you for that certification that you may receive when you graduate, but all of the other skills that are important to become a more employable, more successful, and more happy teacher. I chose it because it would give me a good opportunity to have jobs straight out of high school, and so I can become a paraeducator once I turn 18. A lot of people think education and think that means that they can only be a teacher, but graduating from this program can give you opportunities in a lot of areas, including early childhood education, paraprofessional education as a respite worker or a para in a traditional school setting. But that can also mean you can become something like a community education teacher. You can become a teacher at a museum or other programs in our environment that are education-based. This program is to help young men and young women to prepare to enter the aviation field in a number of different career paths from pilots to ground support to drones and any number of opportunities. I like the aviation program because it provides me with the opportunity to be able to just figure out what I really want to do um, and I think without this program I wouldn't ever even think about doing aviation and it's provided me with a uh, great foundation to begin learning. I think we're at the point where all high schools should be preparing kids for what's next, not simply preparing kids for college, which we will do that as well, but what are the next steps when you get out of high school? Can you contribute to society and contribute to the workplace? We're gonna answer that question for families and get kids ready for whatever life throws at them.